tennis players, are you looking for the best women's tennis sunglasses? Stick around and we'll serve you up. Hey, what's up everyone? It's Steph from SporterX and today I'm going to give you the best tennis sunglasses for women of the year. Before I hop into each frame, I'm just gonna give you an overview of common features that these frames possess that you should look for that are key in any tennis pair of sunglasses. First and foremost, that feature being grip, rubber grip, especially on the nose pads. Temples is a bonus, but you need grip on the nose pad because as you know, as a tennis player, you are in constant motion and you are starting and stopping suddenly and you need something that is gonna be nice and secure on your face. The next thing you need is a good semi-rimless design. A semi-rimless design is gonna give you that lesser obstruction at the bottom here, and that way, when you are kind of looking at lower angles, you have less frame obstruction so that you're not having to look through the frame to see the ball. The other thing to look for is wrap around coverage. So every frame on the table here has an eight base, that's a fancy word of saying curved, wrap around coverage so that you get that nice coverage in the periphery. So when you're, when you're looking through the side, tracking that ball in from the side, you have that nice coverage through the lens. And last but not least is impact resistant lenses. As you know, you have balls that are flying at your face at high speeds and you need that extra protection and that extra give. So make sure that whatever you get in your tennis frames, it is an impact resistant lens and it has an impact resistant frame. These all have polycarbonate lenses, which are the most common sport specific impact resistant lens material. Um, so just make sure that you're protected with that impact resistance on the tennis court. Let's get into it. First and foremost, we'll start with the small end of the table here and work our way up to the larger side of the table. We've got the Tifosi Wist. So as you can see, this is a very small fit. If you have a petite face, this is the frame for you. It has an SFW of 118, which is an extra small, translates to an extra small fit. It has that semi-rimless design. So you've got that open bottom there for that unobstructed view. And a really cool feature about this one is ventilated lenses at the top. So what that does is it helps promote airflow across the surface of the lens, which then helps combat fog. And that's especially important in a game of tennis where you're doing a lot of sudden starting and stopping movement you're generating body heat and you're cooling down. That's just a recipe for fog. So great feature here with the Tifosi Wisp. Next, we have the Rudy Project Ride-On Slim. This is the slimmer version of the Rudy Project Ride-On. So if you need a larger fit, know that there's an option for you. But the Ride-On Slim has an SFW of 130, which is about a medium fit. It has that semi-rimless design. So again, you get that unobstructed view at the bottom and plenty of airflow here going through the sides of the lenses. So there's a nice little divot there to help kind of uh, promote more airflow over the surface of the lens to combat that fog. This is my favorite part about this frame is this grippy adjustable nose pad. Rudy Project puts so much care and attention to detail into their frame design and they've really done a great job with this uh, nose piece here. It keeps it nice and lifted off of your face so that your frame's not resting on your cheekbones. And again, you get that rubber grip, which as you know is super important in the game of tennis. You also have an adjustable uh, temple as well to help um, just adjust even more of a secure fit with the right on slim. Next, we have the Tofosi Mira. This is a women's performance specific design frame. Shout out Tofosi. It has that semi rimless design. You get a nice B measurement, tall lens, basically, which means you get a lot of area of uh, field of view. You also have some ventilation here on the temples, and that just helps combat any moisture buildup when you're getting after it and you're sweating, and it helps with that grip that is so important in the game of tennis. You also have the nose pieces that are adjustable and grippy. So similar to the ride on the ride on slim, you've got that adjustable nose piece, which helps keep that frame lifted from your cheeks. So it's not resting on your face. The SFW measurement for the Tifosi Mira is a 131, which is about a medium fit. Um, again, with that adjustability here on the nose piece that helps with creating a little bit more of a range of fit. And we can't do a best sport sunglasses video without adding a best sport sunglasses brand, which is the Half Jacket 2.0 from Oakley. This is a tried and true frame. It's one of our top sellers. It's one of the best sellers that Oakley offers. And it has, again, that semi-rimless design, interchangeable design. You've got grippy rubber nose pieces here. So it just helps that keep nice and secure on your face and reinforced with the 
uh, rubberized temple grip here as well. The SFW measurement on the Half Jacket 2.0 is a 132, which is about a large fit for women. And last but definitely not least, one of my personal faves on this table is the Nike Trainer. You've got a very slim profile design, super lightweight, of course, very impact resistant, so you're not losing out on any of those sport features. You have a grippy floating nose bridge right here. You've got ventilation that goes through there, so again, helps with that moisture buildup. Same thing on the temple tips as well. Uh, ventilated flow, airflow there. Um, you don't have any grip on the temple, although with that ventilated temple, you do get that, it combats moisture buildup. So it does help with that grip. Um, in addition to that, speaking of impact resistance, because this is a floating nose bridge, you get a little bit more of absorption. So if you do take a ball to the face, you have a little bit more, um, kind of cushion, some give, if you will, to help absorb that impact. In addition to that, you get that wrap eight base coverage, super secure fit. Um, you can interchange the lenses for any different condition or any type of court type, and you need a little bit of contrast or a little bit more brightness protection, depending on the day. Um, you got an SFW measurement in the trainer of 136, which translates to a large fit. That wraps it up for our best women's tennis sunglasses of the year. We hope that gave you the knowledge and information you need to know to make an informed decision on your next pair of tennis sunglasses. Know that our opticians are here to help you out. They're friendly, they're sporty, and they are excited for your call. We also have a ton of other great content, lens guides, um, other frame guides. So if you need more information, our YouTube channel and our blog is a gold mine of information. And also, check us out on social media. We're having fun there. We want to see you there. Thank you so much for watching. We hope that you found this video helpful. If you did find it helpful, please give us a thumbs up. That'll help us get this information out to more people who are looking for it like you. And also, if you did like want to see more content like this, we have a ton going on. So make sure that you subscribe so that you don't miss out. Ring that bell so you know every time we're uploading new content to YouTube. We'll check you later.